A new trading week is here on Wall Street, the first full week of September 2023. But as the markets prepare to kick off, I'd rather do the following for those of us that were here that day in New York, in, that remember the sights, the sounds, the smells. It's hard to believe and wrap around my own head that it's been 22 years already. In addition, I don't, you, you don't, I don't, you don't. We should never forget what happened on that day right here, just a few blocks away on September 11, 2001. And we should all forever remember, honor, and pay tribute to those lives that were lost on that horrible day. I know I haven't forgotten. Forever memorialized in my heart. And now, it's time to move on with the show and talk about the day ahead. Now, following weekly losses, futures on all three major benchmarks firmly higher before the open. NASDAQ, those futures up triple digits as investors buy in on the tech sector's recent dip. And it's set to be a busy week for data. August consumer prices due out Wednesday, while oil prices easing after last week's surge. Hostess brands up nearly 17.5% pre-market after news that JM Smucker will acquire the snack company in a deal worth roughly $5.6 billion. Should these gains hold, TWNK will hit a new record high. Stocks in Asia mixed as investors in the region await China's industrial output, retail sales and housing sale prices and a series of economic data out of Europe as well due out and markets across the pond are higher ahead of those figures. And lastly, some advice. Are you ready for some football? I know I am. It begins today in New York City.